What do you usually do at night? Well, actually, there are so many things that I can do at night. It mainly depends on my moods. If I'm in a good mood, I might hang out with my friends to sing karaoke, eat out, or go to a movie. If I don't feel like hanging out, I might just stay at home, watch TV, listen to music, or surf the internet. Just a small point about the at home. It's not necessarily wrong, but most people would just say, "I might just stay home." And not use any preposition at all. And then, not really related to this answer, but if Chinese is your first language, just make sure you know the difference between eating out and eating outside. What do you usually do at weekends? If the weather is lovely, I might drive out of town for a trip with my families or friends. There are basically too many options. Go camping, riding, or skiing, and all of these activities can add a lot of spice to weekends. But if the weather is lousy, I might just stay at home, watch TV for two days in a row like a couch potato, or have a small get together with my friends. Yeah, it's good. Except again, people just have one family. When is the time you love most during the whole day? Technically, the time I love most is the evening time. It is mostly because I can do whatever I want to help me rewind, take my mind off the stressful study, and add spice to my whole day. How often do you usually hang out? Generally speaking, I hang out once every two weeks. You know, when I am under a lot of pressure at study or work, I would love to take some time off and enjoy life. My motto is, work hard, play harder. Singing karaoke and going clubbing are always my favourite choices. You know, loosen up. Have fun every now and then is a really good thing to do. All right, so if you really do these things, then don't use the word would. Would is for things that you don't really do, but you would do if you had the chance. Do you often have a hangover after having fun for a whole night? Do you often have a hangover? <laughs> so do you get wasted at night? They're never going to ask you this kind of question in our health test. <laughs> Luckily, it has never occurred to me before, and I don't see it happen in the future either. First, I am not a party animal who loves to party for the whole night. Another thing is that I am not an alcoholic, so it leaves no room for me to have a hangover. Just a couple of points about the Lexus. Something occurring and something occurring to someone is not the same thing. If something occurs, of course, it means it happens. If something occurs to you or occurs to me, that means that we remember that or we're thinking about that. And then here, this I don't see it should be happening. And then here, who loves to party for the whole night? Uh, we don't need the preposition. We can just say party the whole night. Now he says he's not a party animal. But in the very next answer, you're going to hear him say, I love parties. <laughs> so which is it? Do you love parties? I love parties. I mean, who doesn't? Parties are always a lot of fun and can relieve the huge pressure at work. Plus, my pals and I always burst into laughter when we hang out together. But don't get me wrong. I'm not a party animal. I just love partying. How often do you usually go to a party? Generally speaking, I go to a party once or twice a month, but it totally depends on whether I am busy with my study or not. If I have lots of exams, I will have to cram for exams, and having fun 
is obviously not on the menu anymore. With whom do you like to party? Your family or friends? I am a family type of person, so I prefer family parties. I enjoy the moment when I chat and have fun with my family at parties. It is the precious quality time. What do you usually do in parties? There are so many options: having drinks and snacks, having chit chat, singing karaoke, dancing together, and playing party games. Anyway, it is all about relaxing and having fun. You know, having parties every now and then can always spice up my usual days. Nothing too major here. Just with the precious quality time, I'd say it's quality time.、Uh, I'd leave out the. I'd argue even leaving out the precious. I mean, if it's quality time, you're already describing it sufficiently. Precious quality seems like overkill using two adjectives. The preposition for parties is at. So, what do you usually do at parties? And for chit chat, I think I mentioned this before. People make chit chat. Or we could just use chit chat as the verb itself.